Well, I grew up watching I Love Lucy reruns, so Lucille Ball has always been a huge inspiration to me. I think she's the epitome of beauty and glamour, and she's hilarious. Um, actually, after researching Lucy a little bit further, I found out that she suffers from the same disease that I do, which is rheumatoid arthritis. And the interesting thing about that is that usually once people are diagnosed with rheumatoid arthritis, they're unable to hold a job, and 95% of them actually become bedridden in some way. But Lucille Ball was diagnosed actually after she became famous and rose above it all and became, in my mind, one of the most inspirational women in history. And just like her, I hope to do the same. My definition of beauty is that to be born beautiful is nothing, but to live beautifully is everything, which is a quote that my favorite Miss Universe, Miss Gloria Diaz 1969 said. And a girl can be aesthetically the most beautiful woman you've ever seen, but if she has a heart full of hatred and a heart full of jealousy, then it's just like she's, it's almost like she becomes the most ugly person you've ever seen. So it's funny, I think that the most beautiful feature about a woman is her smile. My favorite memory was actually this past year when I went to the stockyards for my birthday. I was wearing my brand new American flag boots and I went to go see Willie Nelson in concert at Billy Bob's and I was with my two best friends and it was just one of the most fun things being able to two-step the night away and then of course go to the stockyards which just rich of Fort Worth history. That's one of my favorite things about Fort Worth.